We'll be riding the new Super Sport at its world launch next Tuesday in Spain, on the road and at the Monte Blanco circuit. The new 937cc V-twin machine should be the answer to many sports bike riders' prayers, as the Ducati is a performance bike that most people will actually be able to fit comfortably on. If you think about it, the last comfy sports bike was the hugely popular Honda CBR600F. It was a practical machine that never crushed knees or tortured wrists. But it still went like stink when the mood took you. Modern sports bikes, with their extreme riding positions are fantastic on the track, but a pain on the road for any length of time, especially if you're big. Ducati hopes to change all that with their new XA311 495 Super Sport XA312 795 Super Sport S. It's in a class of its own, really, and the only bikes it compares to are the cheaper, more traditional sports tourers from Japan, like the XA39999. 140 bhp. 235 kilograms Kawasaki Z1000 SX and the XA39999 143 bhp 214 kilograms Suzuki GSX S1000F The 210 kilograms Super Sport is new from the ground up but powered by the same thrill packed L twin engine Yola find in the Hypermotard and Multi Strata 950. The booming 113 bhp motor is tuned for grunt and makes 80% of its 71. 3 FTLB of torque at just 3000 revolutions per minute. So it should have lots of punch out of corners. Trips to the dealers will be reduced thanks to generous 9000 mile service intervals. A new tubular steel trellis frame has steering geometry similar to the Panagales to give the Super Sport sharp handling, but that's tempered by a long wheelbase for stability. Although the Ducati isn't cheap, it comes with a high level of spec, including fully adjustable Marzocchi forks and Saks rear shock, Brembo mono blocks, Pirelli Diablo Rosso three tires and a two-position adjustable screen. It's 